Okay, so I'm gonna vlog with show day number two. I haven't done a lot of vlogging this week. I have honestly felt a little bit tired. Um, as you can tell, I am, or well, if you can tell, God knows if you can. <laughs> um, I am a little bit leaner, a little bit lighter today. Um, feedback was obviously to be a little bit more drawn in from the back, um, but then also still bring good fullness which um, hopefully that obviously presents really well on stage today. I'm doing the Tri-City uh, Classic, it's called. It's here in Columbus, Georgia. First time I've ever been to Columbus, Georgia. There's definitely not a lot to do here, I'll be honest. But the gym that I've been to, obviously I'm not very good at this. <laughs> um, called Iron, Per Iron, Per Iron Gym, I think. Fantastic, great equipment. If there's a problem, they sort it out with the um, any issues. So yeah, just overall, uh, um, a good experience this week with that. I'll probably hit up legs tomorrow there, see how I feel, push up pumps and whatnot. <laughs> anyway, uh, I've got my check-in with Cooper in a minute. I've got to have at least drunk 500 to 750 mils of water before I take a picture. Um, just that obviously it's not completely skinny and flat and pathetic. <laughs> um, but in female bodybuilding, not that they love fullness, but my physique probably looks a bit better on stage and it's a little bit less uh, watery, could we say. So just basically when it's in shape, which is basically everybody, so I'm just chatting shit. Anyway, we'll see what it looks like today. Uh, gonna try and pull up my bikini bottoms a little bit higher as well. I'll try and get them to sit a little bit different and just see how we go with that. I've got Loz here. If any of you follow natural bodybuilding, Loz Vickers is one of my best friends. And I've been very blessed that she's wanted to come out and support me. And I can imagine that it's not been the most fun week for her because, well, I'm not exactly the most chatty. The goodness, having her here has just made a world of a difference. And, I know how loud she'll scream in the crowd and it'll just make me feel even more confident so I'm excited for that. Anyway, we'll get you some stuff behind the scenes today if she can film and whatnot. I'm going to do my check-in. Obviously it'll probably not be filmed this direction so it'll flip flip over to the other direction but fingers crossed you get a good look at it.
obviously that's some footage from stage looking like top two madison the lady who's also uh, in this top two call out with me she's actually a top 12 olympian so it's a real honor to stand next to her uh, we do have very different physiques so we'll have to see what the judges say and then we can just take it from there for next weekend where i will do my final show in the u.s <laughs> So, just got back from the competition, um, so I won, which is exciting, very exciting. Um, my face looks horrendous, <laughs> but my teeth look great. Um, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Um, so, obviously, I got my Olympia qualification and didn't manage to get it last weekend. Was under the impression, I don't know, that I wasn't good enough. Um, and obviously today I proved that I am. I got some really awesome feedback from the head judge Becky. Um, no more size needed um, for the Olympia to bring a tiny little bit more condition, um, but not too much. Uh, she doesn't think that I'm too big or anything like that. It's just that I've got a, a very nice shape and lots of width naturally that's then obviously built some tissue. Um, Obviously, I started my figure journey when I won my pro card in 2018. It's been a very, very long journey to getting where I am. But lots of people laughed at me when I first said that I was going to do figure. And I got, I don't know, a lot, a lot of shit when I first said that I was going to do it. So it's funny, isn't it? But if you are somebody that wants to achieve something that you feel like you can't, just give it your absolute everything and don't care what anyone thinks or what anybody says. We have our ways of bodybuilding and not everybody agrees with them and a lot of people have negative things to say about potentially the, the, the way that we do it and it's very intense and, and whatnot but I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm so appreciative to Cuba I wouldn't be able to have achieved anything that I have now if it wasn't for him business as well as obviously bodybuilding. I'm so appreciative to Aaron who came last week and um, to film sorry that I didn't win last week Aaron and um, massive thank you to Miss Laws who came this week to support me and um, she definitely made my show day very nice and um, my post work not post workout post workout my post um stage meal um is not a big pizza i actually don't like pizza i do like an off-pan meal um like the next best person um bought a big bowl of oats lots of berries and lots of water it's needed to.